December solar and usage update. I have had some updates to the system, mainly around the Victron Quattro inverter, which is part of my vehicle to home installation. And there is a few more videos about that within the channel. Um, we're still using the infrared heating system, so no central heating at all on the on the wet water system. And we used a massive 2.5 megawatt hours of electricity during December. And we had a solar contribu contribution of 135.4 kilowatt hours. We got 425.2 kilowatt hours from the Tesla Powerwall. And we pulled 2.42 from the national grid. We were 22% self-powered so that's from the power wall or from solar and the tesla power wall is telling me that we saved 120 pounds this month and that's based on being on the octopus intelligent tariff and our solar contribution was five percent of our home usage our three sma inverters um, produced a total of 135.4 kilowatt hours which was 67.2 kilowatt hours from our roof array or the upper roof array. The lower roof array produced 57.5 kilowatt hours and our small 1.2 low array on the wall produced 10.7 kilowatt hours. During December, we did 694 miles in the e-golf and the MG5 and that came out at a cost of £23.97. Our average cost per kilowatt hour during December from what we pulled from the grid was 16 pence per kilowatt hour and our average cost per kilowatt hour in December including the solar was 15 pence per kilowatt hour. And during the whole of 2022 our average price is now 5.2 pence per kilowatt hour which I'm over the moon with. I'm not gonna go into any huge detail of where the energy went um, in December, but basically 51% of it went on heating, 13% uh, of it went on car charging. Um, hot water was 9%, cooking was 3%, clothes washing and drying was 1%, and the rest of it was hot, uh, the general home usage. Feel free to pause the video if you're interested in the costs that we had during December. And finally, we can summarise up all of um, 2022 with our costs. So we're 130 days grid free. We did 8,781 miles at a cost of £116.77. We imported 10,346 kilowatt hours. We got 8,682.1 kilowatt hours from our solar. So that's a total electricity kilowatt hours of 19,028.1 kilowatt hours. And that cost us 1,185 pounds and 12 pence. We did have our gas cut off in March, but we did have a, a January, February and March bill of 21 pounds and 96 pence. So that's in there. So that's a total utility bill of £1,207.08. But we did get four FIT payments totaling £2,355.03. So that left us a balance of £1,147.95. And that includes all VAT and daily charges in credit for 2022. So that's another successful year of free um, tra traveling and running a home on electric heating during 2023 i'm going to make these videos a lot shorter but as usual thanks for watching and please like and subscribe and i'll leave you with the day by day tesla data